Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Caitlin Anwin for anyone who's new here and let's get back into Planet Zoo. And we are continuing with Maya's Sunshine Happiness Zoo. And let's get into it. So what do we need to do? Uh, we need to adopt and place a West African lion and a reticulated giraffe. Okay, let's have a look. Right, so we have a boy and a girl a giraffe and we have a boy and a girl lion, but not enough cash for everything. So, what do I do? Do I get the boy lion who's only three? And maybe the female giraffe? Longevity is not very good on that. I'm gonna have to get one with cash and one with uh, conservation credits and um, because I can't afford that it's gonna have to be this one and I might wait for the giraffe and do the lion first right we're just waiting for our lion to come in now I have downloaded like a pride rock looking cave for the lions I hope it is okay and it looks like it's coming in <sighs> We've got lions, tigers, and bears in our, our uh, zoo. Yay, look! A lion! Okay, you got no enrichment. Oh, loving the hard shelter. I just need to do some terrain. And they don't like a few of the plants. Okay, I can sort that out. Let's just have a check on the market a minute. Keep waiting out for that giraffe while I sort out all these plants. Okay, so we have enough conservation credits to get a seven year old uh, reticulated giraffe. And it's pretty fertile and it's the youngest one. So I'm gonna adopt that one. We were doing well with the lion enclosure. Is he good? Social group, yeah, you could do with a friend, but other than that, I've got everything sorted. Let's have a look at our big boy by you. Oh, that is adorable. Oh, I completely... There we go. <laughs> I'm going to have to put that back as well. I think I forgot to do that last week as well. Sorry about that. Oh, he's so cute. This zoo is so weird. Where can I put this giraffe? Hmm. Clearly not mapped this out right, have I? <laughs> they give the lion too much room. I guess the giraffe could go back here and I could try and move the keeper's hut. Ah, we'll see. <laughs> yeah. Right the then! Here comes a giraffe! Hey! I've heard from the staff that you're making them very happy. <laughs> That's good, because I dread to think what they'd do to you if they weren't. My best guess? They'd get you a birthday card, but then deliberately get your name wrong in it. <laughs> I well bet they done, done that turning way. such a good profit, although it could be better. So make it better. Oh, seriously, fuck off, Dom. I can't wait not to have him. <laughs> there we are, I don't have to have that in anymore or oh, isn't she gorgeous he gorgeous i think i think he can you get in your house did i make it accessible surely you can get in there yeah you can get in there nice oh there you go what's up space social group oh they don't like being on their own either Oh, and I haven't quite got enough space. Okay, I'll sort that out. And then what we got to do next? Staff happiness, 90% for the duration of the reporter's visit. Oof. And then habitat species overall, 90% for the duration. Breed a cheetah. Breed, oh, I've done the orangutan. And we need a desert animal and aquatic. What? Oh, is 
is that like alligator? That could be an alligator. I didn't think of that. Alright then, we need to breed the cheetah and get the staff happiness up and the habitat species happiness up. Okay. Right, okay, so for the next part we need a desert animal and an aquatic animal. Okay, you are gonna be annoying, are you? There we go. Uh, let's get rid of that a minute. Uh, so, an aquatic animal is a saltwater crocodile, so we're gonna get one of those. Should I just spend all of my conservation credits and get some silver ones? And I'm a little bit concerned about the cheetahs because they've constantly got low wel welfare because they get stressed a lot. I have put like plants and stuff in the way to stop them seeing the guests and I am researching the two-way glass which I'm almost there on. Just need to do that one and then obviously I can get the one-way glass which will mean the, the cheetahs are happier but I've got a really old male and I don't really know what to do. I don't think the female is, like the female's got a little bit longer, but there's no cheetahs in our list. I do have it on there. So I'm not sure about the task to breed one new cheetah, but I'm getting the welfare slowly up. I've got it up like 20% at the moment. Those cheetahs are really dragging me down. And I'm getting some vet research done for the giraffes. That's good. I've got two done for the giraffes now. I'll take that one off. And let's go for the zebras. But yeah, those cheetahs are constantly stressed. So I'm just going to have to wait that out a little. Now, I'm guessing the saltwater crocodiles could basically just live in this river. Because they don't need all that much, like, land. So I'm going to see if I can sort out the crocodiles living in the river. And look how much money we have. Ah, it's amazing. Right, so here is our crocodiles in as well. Whoop, there they are. And they keep getting boxed and reboxed for some reason. Strange, and hopefully, is that, yep, that's the aquatic animal done. <sighs> okay, and let's see, they're really not happy, are they? Okay. I shall sort that out. Wow, okay. Hmm, that was saying I had loads more before. Okay, let's sort that out. And then the only thing I've got to do next is a desert animal. Right, we've got our saltwater crocodile super happy now as well. So that's going good. How am I doing an overall welfare now? We're on 81%. And I've actually got a cheetah in the thing. And a West African lion actually, but I don't have any conservation credits at the moment. Oops. <laughs> okay, so I've found a few desert animals and the gems box seem the cheaper so i think i'm gonna get them and yeah why not fertility that one's more fertile Ooh, which one's more okay that one's gonna last longer let's grab that one too and that'll be our last animal oh no yeah, that's one cheetah dead. Oh no. No. Oh, that is gutting. And we don't have long until that female's gone as well. Oh no. Ah, oh, we got a male, but I don't have enough conservation credits for it. Oh no. 
Everything's going wrong. Right, so this is going to be the last animal to be added into the zoo. It's a jet box. So we have an animal from each biome now. Aren't you just gorgeous? I really do love these animals. I love the gem spark. They're so pretty. Ah, amazing. Love it. Okay, so let's give this a pause. How is this? Uh, that needs sorting. So we need our habitat species to be overall welfare of 90%, and we need to breed one new cheetah. And I can't breed a new cheetah because we've only got a female left. So what I'm gonna do is uh, play off camera and pop in once I've got that all sorted. And just to show you what gold is like. Well, the sun has set since I have started playing this. It has taken a long while. I've been recording for almost two and a half hours now and yeah so i'm gonna have to play off camera and save up my conservation credits and spent them all oops definitely shouldn't have done that but never mind so we need to get another cheetah so here is me completing this level hopefully finally yes oh, well you look at all those different types of animals I couldn't even tell you what half of them are. <laughs> no, I should probably pay oh more God, attention to I the Oh my God, I hate paperwork. you so much. You've done a very good job here. And I know it hasn't been easy, especially after I replaced the company's health and safety officers with health or safety officers. But it was all for a good cause, wasn't it? What? The animals? No, my public image. You know, before I got into the zoo business, I had a terrible reputation. It cut off certain avenues, but now people are falling over themselves to do business with me. So trust me when I say that I'm not going to forget the work you... Uh, did he stop talking for you? Oh dear. Oh well. That's him done, and we got gold. Thank God for that! Oh dear me. So I literally had that inspector go around uh, maybe four times now. I thought I had this like four times. I had like over 95%, I had 99% at one point the whole way through and it did not go. But finally, 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 finally. So the zoo looks a little different, obviously. I trashed most of the animals to keep them above 90% so I got rid of almost half of my animals <laughs> to make sure that we kept the welfare up. The zebras were the next to go if they weren't behaving. <laughs> I was getting rid of those. But yeah, I actually had to restart the whole zoo to get the cheetahs to breed. So I just restarted what I played basically just now for you. Um, the cheetahs actually got three babies at once when I replayed it. <laughs> so I was baffled by that, but I got a little clip that, you know, um, they died in my gameplay with you guys. I replayed it and they had three at once so there you go we did end up getting cheetahs and since I recorded this episode and obviously I've been playing for the past two days off camera trying to get this reporter to see my animals are really happy we have had a planet zoo announcement we're going to be getting the South America pack which they got some new animals in it and obviously new like building items but unfortunately there are no career scenarios so next week we're gonna have a little go at a sandbox zoo and have a look at the new animals that's coming with the south america pack because that's coming out on the 7th of april okay so i think i've got 
I've caught you up with everything. Hopefully we don't have Dom again because he is really annoying. <laughs> I, I really hate him. I hope we are with Emily next scenario. But next week we're going to be in sandbox mode and we shall be having a look at the new South American animals that come with the pack. So there you go. Back to face cam me from two days ago. <laughs> Right then, I'm going to end this here. Hopefully we got gold. <laughs> Obviously, I don't quite know right now, but hopefully we did. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, smash that like button and let me know which animal is your favorite in this zoo. I think I'm gonna have to go for the lions now. I think the lions have overtaken the cheetahs for me. I definitely enjoyed putting a lion in with Pride Rock. <laughs> if you haven't already and you would like to, it would mean a lot to me if you could subscribe and hit the bell to be notified whenever I upload a new video. I upload on Tuesdays, Thursdays and Saturdays. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a wonderful day and I will see you next time. Goodbye.